Live. CBS 3 Eyewitness News at 4. Well, in a woman's view today, skating through midlife, it's not always as easy if you have kids and a career. Got that right. Alicia Lane is here with a woman who has found her passion in a very chilly place. Susan and Angela, it is an activity that calls for sheer determination, nerves of steel, and muscles just as hard. If you think you need to be young to play this game, meet one woman who's put her sport on ice. I always wanted to be Peggy Fleming. That was my dream in life as a little girl. Now at age 50, Janet Rosen of Wynwood is pursuing that dream. It's a challenge taking up figure skating as an adult. We have world and Olympic level skaters training here. I mean, they're, they're young, they're 18, they're 19, and I am frequently very self-conscious. There is basically one thing I'm afraid of in skating, and that's embarrassing myself. But that doesn't keep her from competing in ice dancing and synchronized skating. I think what it takes more than anything else is um, courage. Like most of us, she skated as a child for fun. Then at age 45, she became serious. She began training with John Thomas, a former Olympic skater. She has got an endless energy, um, sort of a youthful spirit that she she really, really wants to sort of keep, you know, the fire burning. Janet raised two children and earned a PhD in pathology. But when it comes to skating, it is without a doubt the most difficult thing I've ever done. It, it's given me a tremendous sense of accomplishment. And dozens of medals. These are a couple of gold medals. Janet has even rubbed elbows with Olympic champions Michelle Kwan, Oksana Bayul, and Victor Petrenko. She gladly offers this advice on ice and life. You do fall. I mean, and you fall. Everybody falls, but you fall and you get up. If there is something that you have always wanted to do and you have the opportunity to do it, just go do it. How about it? Janet isn't stopping and she says she can't wait to do what's called a death spiral. She's training to qualify for the synchronized nationals in Colorado Springs in February. And Janet skates at the Philadelphia Skating Club in Ardmore, PA. Susan, mm, I cool, right? it to her. Isn't yeah, that great? that's awesome. And you know what's amazing yeah. about that is when you're a kid, you know, you're, you don't have that fear. You just go and do the jumps. Right. When you get older, you're kind of yeah. like, you fall harder. But she seems yeah. to have that childlike spirit. You're a little heavier then. <laughs> yeah, really. Good Thanks, point. Elise. Thank you. Yeah.